Hello, my name is Wes Kempa from LifeRay. And in this five minute video, I'll be explaining LifeRay's capabilities around its integration with DocuSign and its ability to send requests for digital signature right through the documents and media functionalities of LifeRay. In this case, I am signed in as an administrative user, uh, somebody who at least has permissions to get into the documents and media and to send a request for somebody to complete a digital signature process. It doesn't necessarily have to be a full administrator. Uh, this has been in LifeRay as a capability for many generations of the product. However, I will be demonstrating it from LifeRay's 2023 fourth quarter release. I'll open up the documents and media section seen here. And I do have some documents that we can use uh, in this uh, example agreement. I can use the three dot menu to see that the collect digital signature option is available. This becomes available when you configure LifeRay through the control panel. You've added all of the information required for your DocuSign account. Then you see this link. We're going to click on it, and then we're prompted for information that will be needed for that DocuSign request process. I'm going to say complete the contract, and we have an email address we can use. Kevin Williams. We'll send a, a message to Kevin Williams here, and we will say complete the contract. And we'll give a nice message to Kevin saying, please and sign and return the enclosed agreement as soon as possible. We'll send that off and that will be shared with Kevin through email. There you go. So in this case, um, he receives this message in his email account. Uh, because I'm using a DocuSign Sandbox account, I have a warning here. This is only for demonstration, uh, but the same is true for production accounts. I, I'd get this blue box with review document. And at this point, I'm not within LifeRay anymore. I'm within DocuSign, and I can complete that signing process in whatever form it is necessary. If that is to uh, fill in fields or provide a signature, you can do that here and click finish. Once that process is done uh, for Kevin, his responsibilities are complete. We can go back to uh, Daryl's view and see the digital signature section. In this case, we can see that recently that process with the recipient Kevin Williams has been completed and he can Click in to get more information. Below, we see some specifics about what was sent to Kevin and the original document that was sent. This download button in the upper right, certainly important. It contains all of the information held by DocuSign regarding this transaction. If I click this and download, I will get a collection of content related to that process. The agreement. Here I see the signature provided by Kevin Williams in the final document that was prepared and the summary of all of that, the data related to the transaction, uh, the content within the document, the signature provided, and all of the timestamps related to the steps taken throughout. I hope this information is useful to you in understanding the capabilities of LifeRay's integration with DocuSign.